Hey guys, you clicked that link today. You're wanting to see another home in Wilton Park here in the mid 600s. Stay tuned to the end. You'll get another good view of what you can expect to get for that amount of money here when purchasing a home in Wilton Park. Hey guys, I'm James Dean, team leader of the James Dean Mountain Homes team. Thank you so much for watching these videos. Just really quick before we get into the meat of this video, I just wanted to make sure if you haven't done so already, hit that subscription button down below, hit that notification bell. That keeps you updated on all the new videos that we have coming out weekly. And uh, we've got several that come out each week um, on this channel. So please, please stay up to date with that. Also, if you've got any questions whatsoever that are real estate related or just in the community, please don't hesitate to reach out to us and give us a call. You can either call us at 719-266-2725 five you could text us to that number as well or you can email us at info at jdmret.net please whatever you got to do to get those questions to us please ask we're here to help we're here to provide value to you and in helping you make informed decisions whether you're looking to buy or sell real estate or just typical questions for the community out here we are local experts of this area and we love this area so please 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 reach out to us and we hope you guys enjoy this video all right guys here we are at a house in the Wilden park area in the mid 600s this house was built in 1998 it is a very good example of what you can expect to get in the mid 600s here in the town of Wilton Park we've got wood floors we've got a little bit of a dated kitchen home was built in 1998 that kitchen was probably original nice size backyard that we'll come in and capitalize on later they've got a nice gas fireplace in here they've also got nice vaulted ceilings throughout here too you get lots of nice natural light and we'll come on back here. We'll take a look at the dining room. Uh, so pretty traditional in the 90s. They weren't really as open floor plan. We we're just kind of getting into that. We got a nice powder room right here too, coming in off that main level. And then we'll come on into the main level master living. So we got carpet coming into here, nice large walk-in closet, nice big open area with a nice big window. And then coming into a nice uh, five piece bathroom here as well with a nice jacuzzi tub stand up shower and double vanity next we'll come on down and we're going to head on downstairs and take a look at the unfinished basement so as we come around the corner we'll head on down and down we go this is a nice unfinished basement that leaves tons of space for adding extra bedrooms and living space to in the home this home like i said was built in 1998 it's 4,030 square feet but only 200 2,664 square feet are finished you can see with the insulation down here it's already got the ducking too it's got nice windows down here you could put another bedroom nice family room down here you got a furnace and hot water heater down here as well they've also got plumbing for another bathroom that's down here too but it is the exact same footprint as the main living area on the main level upstairs which just adds a ton of extra space and extra possibilities to you and your family we'll go ahead and we'll come on back up we're going to go check out the upstairs area and as we head upstairs just want to point out um you know this is a one and a half story home uh framed on lots it's down here it's in Wilden park and it is a three bedroom three bath with a two car attached garage we're back on carpet coming up the stairs to the other bedrooms and as we come right on up we've got the other bedrooms up here that split off a little common area so we got uh, the second bedroom here with the closet some shelves and shelving looking out on the backyard the third bedroom is right up here in the corner as well with its closet looking out into the backyard also and then we'll come in and we'll take a look at this nice full bath here that's on the second floor where you've got a nice shower tub combo and then this is really interesting they've got this neat little it's almost like a secondary master suite it's got a little bit of a walk down over the garage here very very large area it's got a window looking back out to the front it's got neat little built-ins with a little wet bar up here too uh, but a really really cool place to check out so definitely something that's really interesting to see you don't see a lot of these but you can definitely put a lot of that to good use now as we get ready to head on out to the backyard area um, we've i also just wanted to point out this house is sitting uh, just on uh, just over 0.5 acres uh, just like most towns here or most sit most homes here in Wilton park excuse me they're all on city water as well as sewer 
as well. This one's got natural gas going into it too. Now, the deck here definitely needed a little bit of work, a little bit of uh, repainting on it, more than likely the original wood. Some of the stucco along the sides also needs a little bit of work too, but this is pretty typical where you're going to see in the big 600s here in Wilden Park. You'll see a nice home with a lot of great bones, but probably going to need some room or some, some work on the home itself just to bring it up to date with everything that we have. So you can see a lot of the neighbors out here in this neighborhood do a great job taking care of their yards, take a lot of pride and ownership on that. Um, and we've got uh, this half acre lot that we're walking around on with this great entertaining area here on the outside as well, which is also a wonderful place to just enjoy the evenings in the summertime. Um, nice cobblestone patio that sits out here to really just capitalize on this outdoor living space. And keep coming on around, you can see we've got landscaping around the house. And we'll come all the way back around here to the front and you'll get a good idea of what the front looks like and the street looks like. Nice, quiet neighborhood. Hope you guys like this style of home and we'll be showing you more things like this in the Woodland Park area. Guys, I really hope that you enjoyed that video. And once again, before you sign off, make sure you hit that subscription button, that notification down, bell down below. That will keep you updated on all the new videos that we have come out that are here to inform you and help keep you updated on what's happening here, both in the community and in real estate as well. And once again, too, if you've got any questions, please do not hesitate to give us a call. 719-266-2725. You could text us at that number as well, or you can email us at info at jdmret.net, and we will get back to you as quickly as possible to answer all of those questions. We're here to serve you, and we look forward to helping you soon.